The Universal Periodic Review is a unique mechanism of the United Nations. This mechanism aims at improving the human rights situation in each of the 193 UN member states. The UPR is a five-year cycle process comprised of three key stages. First, the review in Geneva of the human rights situation in the state under review. Second, the implementation between two reviews of recommendations made to the state under review. Third, the assessment at the next review of the implementation of those recommendations and the developments of the human rights situation in the country since the previous review. Three main documents underpin each review. A national report written by the state under review. In this context, the state is encouraged to conduct national consultations with national civil society in order to reflect their concerns and to comprehensively assess the domestic human rights situation. A compilation by the Office of the High Commission of Human Rights of information from treaty bodies, special procedures and UN agencies. A summary drafted by the OHCHR based on the information received from national institutions and CSOs. The review in Geneva consists of three steps. First, the state is reviewed during three and a half hours by a working group comprising all UN member and observer states. These states make recommendations on how to improve the human rights situation in the state under review. This exercise results in a draft report containing, on average, 200 recommendations. Second, the draft report is adopted by the working group a few days after the review. Third, the draft report is formally adopted at the Human Rights Council a few months later. At this stage, the state on review must declare which recommendations are supported and which are noted. The UPR is a truly universal process as it reviews all UN member states and takes into consideration all human rights from civil and political rights to economic, social and cultural rights, regardless of the size or human rights situation in a given state. At the UPR, states are reviewed by states. Nonetheless, civil society, national institutions, the media and the citizens have a great role to play. They can provide information before the review of their states and assess and support the implementation of recommendations.